Hey guys, welcome to my kitchen. I'm Julia. It is time for some delicious garlic bread dinner pinwheels. There's going to be some Parmesan cheese on there and some garlic and butter and parsley. They're absolutely delicious. They are yummy on their own, but also to some tomato soup or another soup or just as a side dish with some salad and some meat. It is so good, so let's just get started, guys. I have to start with my dough because it needs time to rise. So in my bowl here, I'm going to add in some fresh yeast. You can also use dry yeast. And with some sparkling water. And I'm just going to let this set for about five minutes. Just give it a quick whisk. with some salt and sugar, eggs, melted butter, last but not least in with the left of flour. Just stir it until everything is well combined and have a nice and sticky dough. Then I'm just going to cover up and let it rise for about an hour or until double in size. It has been around one hour and my dough rise nicely. I just cut in half and roll one half out because my table is really small so I don't have room for one whole portion. So I just do one half at a time when I've done this one, of course make the other one. But I'll only show you guys how to make this half. But the recipe is of course for one portion down below. My oven is already at 180 degrees C convection oven or at about 550 degrees Fahrenheit convection. But as you can see, I've just rolled out one half with some flour on the table so it don't stick. And here I have some melted butter, some crushed garlic and some fresh parsley. And it's just all about brushing it on. And then last but not least, on some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. Just kind of close it fingers and cut it. on a baking sheet just give them all a little push they are now ready to bake in the oven for about 12 to 15 minutes after they are ready to be saved I'll just dig in. Mm, mm, mm. Top is nice and crunchy. Inside, so soft. Nice garlic flavor. And then the Parmesan cheese in there. Mm. I don't add a lot of Parmesan in mine. 
because I don't want it to be overpowering. But if you like it, you can always add in lots of more Parmesan cheese. I always use this dough because of the sparkling water, it makes the dough so soft and nice and keeps it moist and delicious for days. It doesn't dry out at all and yeah. Just give me a go guys, all of me in the down below, don't forget to subscribe here. And I hope to see you guys again tomorrow. Bye!